Is natural selection the same as evolution? Well, many people assume that it is. It's assumed that evolution proceeds by natural selection, by which they think that somehow new features are going to be selected in a population of organisms. But that's not the way it happens. There is something that's like natural selection, though actually the term natural selection is somewhat illogical because nature can't actually select anything. Nature is not a person. Uh, to actually use the phrase natural selection is a, a logical fallacy known as reification. But nevertheless, there's some form of selection of genetic information. That selection could, in a sense, be termed natural because it's to do with the environment, it's to do with the various conditions that there are. But there has to be information existing in the first place from which that selection can take place. So when a new species develops, and new species do indeed develop, but when those new species develop, they develop because of rearrangement or even loss of existing information from within the created kind where the new species has developed. No new genetic information is produced because the spontaneous production of new genetic information would in fact be scientifically impossible and would fall foul of the first law of information science, which says that information does not arise spontaneously from matter. So it's very important to understand that this sort of selection may indeed take place. When it does, it is not evolution. It is not the supposed upward march of organisms going from molecules to mankind.